What's up, everybody? It's Josh here. I've got a quick, fun tutorial for you in this one. I'm going to show you how to replace WordPress post featured images as videos. This is actually really easy to do, and we're going to do this without any plugins. And we're going to come up with this look here where these are WordPress posts. But typically, with WordPress posts, you're going to see something more like this. I'm in my tutorial area, and these are all posts. But you'll notice that these are just whatever image I put as the featured image. Then you would click off to go to the post. Well, in this one, if you have videos, you can do it to where you can click off to the whole post or you can watch the video directly from the featured image or the thumbnail. Super cool, right? Very easy to do as well. And you'll you'll probably have seen this look in a variety of sites. I'm on a podcast called Divi Chat and it's set up like that to where you could go into these posts or you could just click the thumbnail and you could watch it there. And a client actually recently, they had a bunch of video quick tips that they wanted to put on their website. I showed them this and they loved that idea. So that's what we're gonna do. So first things first, let's do a new post and we're gonna come back to this page. It's very easy to do. Let's call this video thumbnail four since I was on three there. Now you do need to do this as a post. This will this will not work as a page. So you need to do a post in WordPress. And most of you know that I use Divi, but this is not a Divi specific tutorial. This will work on whatever WordPress theme you use. Now here's the big thing. When you do this, you'll notice that down here, there's a little section I have open called format. You need to make sure you have this uh, shown. So up under screen options, you'll have a variety of options. You need to make sure that you have, uh, where is it? There's format. You need to make sure that format is checked. Otherwise you're not gonna see it. So when that's checked, that brings open the window. And then you'll see that there are format types. All we need to do is select video. This will make it so whatever thumbnail or whatever featured image is put in there, uh, it's going to show a video instead of the, the thumbnail. Uh, so very, very cool. Now, apart from this, all you need to do is actually post the video in the content right here to display it. So let's go to a video I've got ready for us. And in this case, I'm gonna do share. And we're gonna take just this link. You don't wanna do the embed code. The embed code's not gonna work. It just needs to be the share link. And as we copy this, let's go back to the post. Let's drop this into the text side. I think you might be able to drop it on this side, but it's gonna show the video like that. So I would recommend that you drop it into the text side. So, uh, which is where you're gonna wanna put any of your HTML or anything you have. So let's do that. And let's make sure, let's see, I've got a little test category set up here for this post and let's publish this. Now, when we go back to the uh, test page I showed you, we should see this fourth video. And hey, would you look at that? How cool, very easy, right? All we did was we created a new post, gave it a title, uh, made sure that format was selected under our screen options so we could see those options and we just set it to video. And then any video that you put here, I'm not sure to be honest if it works the same for Vimeo or some of these other uh, video hosts. I imagine it does, but YouTube does work. But again, you want to do just the link itself. You don't wanna do the full embed code. And then it's gonna display nicely like that. Now, one question is, if I were to post this uh, blog post on social media, how would that display? Is it gonna pull up the video? No. So what I would recommend doing is you can still post a featured image and let's pick a good featured image for that post. So I've already had this in there. Let's go ahead and update that. And then now, when we go back out to the page, you'll notice that it's going to change this from the YouTube overlay playing to watch this as we refresh. Now it's gonna have the same look that we saw on the Divi Chat podcast website to where it doesn't have that YouTube play, but what it's doing is it's actually displaying whatever featured image I give this post instead of the featured image of the YouTube video. But have no fear because when you click play, it'll still play that YouTube video. So very, very cool. So I wanted to show you that because when you post a video in here, you don't have to do a thumbnail, but again, if you start posting that on other social media sites, it's not gonna display a nice thumbnail. So I would recommend in a lot of cases, adding a featured image if you want to. And again, that's gonna display, let's refresh one more time just so you'll see how that will display. Because again, it gives it a different look. And this may depend on your theme. This is where things may change a little bit. I'm using Divi, so this is how it displays there. But very easy. Very cool little trick if you want to display videos in your thumbnails and WordPress. All right, guys, enjoy and have some fun, and I'll see you in another tutorial.